Today, guys, we're going to find out if Lucas Pure Synthetic Oil Stabilizer, also known as Lucas Heavy Duty Oil Stabilizer, and Marvel Mystery Oil, will destroy your engine. So, you're about to find out. Also, we'll see if they can help get rid of those pesky noises coming with inside the engine. As you can see right here, we have a sound meter. With the sound meter, we're going to be able to see what the sound is before and after using the Lucas and Marvel Mystery Oil. So we're going to give this guy an oil change, use our Wix XP oil filter, and some Mobile Warm Full Synthetic Motor Oil. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into the test. Here's what the vehicle sounds like before using Marvel Mystery Oil or Lucas. You can see on the decimal meter. So here we have the engine at operating temperature and as you can see the decimal meter is uh, 92.3, 93.0, 94.7, 96.5. Alright, now it's time for us to go ahead use these products and see are they going to hurt our engine and will they even make a difference to help engine noise like uh, ticking lifters, knock, things of that nature. Well. If they can't help this engine sound in any way, then it's definitely not going to help any of those problems. So let's go ahead, jump into the rest of the test. How about the Marvel Mystery Oil? We're going to go ahead and add this right now. You can add Marvel Mystery Oil before the oil change. So 300 miles before the oil change is what Marvel recommends, replacing up to 20% of your oil. So if you have a five quart system, it'd be one full quart of Marvel Mystery Oil. Also, if you have any concerns about thinning out your oil, they'll answer every question fairly easily on the website. Another way you can use this product is after you change your oil, you can add this to the oil at that time. But we're going to do this 300 miles before changing our oil. One of the biggest problems when using fuel additives, changing your oil, a lot of companies recommend not even filling your oil filter. But the main reason they say to do this is because they don't want you to contaminate anything. So the more chance you do anything, especially your oil filter, then you could cause contamination, which I do fill my oil filter, but I recommend being very safe. I use this and I know it helps out some. It has an extension that comes out right here. You can get these fairly cheap on Amazon or eBay. You see the little screen inside, it pops in and out. You wouldn't believe all the gunk I've trapped up using that. Well, looks like now it's time to begin our 300 mile journey. You want to go ahead and put a scotch behind your tire to make sure that your vehicle does not roll as you jack it up. Next, you want to go ahead and jack your vehicle up. Well guys, here we are back after 300 miles and it's time to drain our oil. Guys, this is by far the best way to take off oil filters. As you can see, it has a place for a ratchet to go in, so all you need is the strap and a ratchet. And this will take off just about any oil filter. I've never run into one that I wasn't able to take off with this one. There's only one oil filter to use, Wix XP. Obviously I dropped that one. All right, now we have our Wix XP filled up. We're gonna install our oil filter back on and show you guys the results. Now we're gonna go ahead and take our jack stand out. 
lower the vehicle so when we add our oil we'll have the proper oil level Well guys, did this actually damage the engine? We're getting ready to find out. So, just like the Marvel Mystery Oil, you had 20% of this Lucas formula. So, one quart out of five quarts in the oil system. And I'm very curious to see how this affects the engine noises and sounds. Will this actually stop any engine noise? Well, the decimal meter is going to show us that for sure. This stuff isn't nearly as thick as the heavy duty oil stabilizer formula. Time to go ahead and add our Mobile One Extended Performance. We've already added our Lucas Pure Synthetic Stabilizer. Now it's time to make sure we have the right amount of oil. And it looks like we're ready to go. Let's go ahead and move on to the next part of the test. So did this actually make a difference? Let's take a closer look at the decimal meter and find out. Well guys, it would appear that we actually done better this time. Once we added the chemicals, the Marvel Mystery Oil, Ran it through the system for 300 miles. You can see our reading was up to 97 the first time at operating temperatures. Now here we are, better reading, and it didn't destroy our engine. So, thank you guys for watching Nate's Interactive Auto. Till next time, get ready to get wrenching for the next upcoming video.